Hello, so I've got a brand new Steve Cavallero deck. I'm going to show you how to grip it. So, um, yes, very nice board. And also what we're going to do is we're going to cut this out as well. So the, um, yeah, so it shows the whole thing off in its full glory. So I've got some um, tracing paper, lovely pink colour. And we've got a knife, a file, some glue, oh, a pencil, and uh, that's it. Oh, and of course, grip tape. So, first things first, uh, I'm going to draw around this. So, get some cellar tape and tape some something down there. Now, you want to make double 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 sure it's not going to move around so uh, make sure it's sort of taped tightly on both sides like that so you're not moving anywhere because that would be a disaster uh, okay tape that there and one more the luck at the top. Right, so there we go. Okay, so draw around it. Um, and for the sake of um, this, this board's not too bad because the image is quite symmetrical. But on some images, some images the it might not be symmetrical. And when you cut it out with the grip tape, um, you might end up end up cutting it out the wrong way round. So it's handy to write a kind of where you are on the skateboard. So, uh, so that'd be a top, uh, bottom, of course, and then this is the left side of my deck, and that'll be the right side. Just so you know what's what way round it is when you come to cutting out. Okay, so uh, let's let's start up here. Now it doesn't have to be spot on, but as long as you get the rough shape of it. Uh... Right, okay, so, so right, so we've got a board, we got our rip tape. And we got our picture all traced out. So the next thing to do is we want to put our board on the grip tape just to kind of mark it out a little bit. Um, so we want to make sure we've got enough grip both ends. And it's a nine inch board, so you want to kind of stick it in the, in the middle there somewhere. And sort of make sure you've got lots of space around it. Uh, okay. Sort of. There-ish. Okay, it's not too important. But, but you know, you've got enough room around it. There we go, roughly there. So if I just mark out the grip tape a bit so I know kind of roughly where my board is. Need a better pen really. Uh, let's see if I can get a marker pen. So basically mark mark where the wings are gonna be. Round about there, round about there. Obviously you need to mark your picture up however uh, however it suits your picture. So take that off there. Now you're probably wondering why it's gone a bit sticky. Silly me, I put some glue on here before I did that. So what I wanted to do is put some glue here, which I've done. 
and then stick this on in the right place so I can draw around it without it keep on, well, cut around it without it keep on moving. So um, I've got my right and left. Now I'm gonna come up here to right, find there. Maybe if I get it in the middle. I can see I've got a gap on that side and a gap on that side and got lots of space either end. I've kind of roughly marked out where my wings are going to be, which is there and it's a bit off there and there, but it should be okay because I've got plenty of room either end. So we'll give it a try. Cross your fingers, here we go. I'm gonna stand up for this. Uh, you don't need to go hard the first time round, it's just kind of Marking it. Okay, so we've uh, cut the hole out. There's the piece that I took out. Um, basically, I went round the the uh, knife, cut it all out, and uh, now for for the moment of truth. Uh, Got the skateboard and it's pretty much a good fit. So uh, next step is to stick the grip on. So what I'm going to do is because I want the picture to be, you know, spot on. What I'm going to do is I'm going to cut the grip tape down here and start from the middle and work my way out. I don't want to start on the end because you know it will it just won't match up. Careful not to rip the grip tape where where the join is. A bit fiddly. there just, I'm just going to take it to the bottom of the wings to the top of that wing just for now same on the other side All nice and clean. Right. 
hang it up. start with these wings here. Too heavy, just in case. Mm. Okay, so um, basically, managed to stick it all in place and roll out the, the grip to either end. Uh, make sure there's no bubbles anywhere. Um, if you do get a little bubble, you could always stick your knife in it and it'll disappear. Uh, fold down the edges as much as you can. Um, around the board. Now the next bit is to get your trusty old file out and start filing around the edges like that. Okay, so I've uh, I finished going around with the old file, and um, it's not looking too bad. You know, one one gripped deck. Um, the only thing I would say is because this is an old old school board, the sides are uh, painted. So obviously, when you're doing the old filing, it took off some of the paint. So I've gone around, tried to sort of tidy it up a bit with a marker pen or whatever. I know it will come off in the rain, but just for now it's okay uh, there we go one uh, gripped lovely skateboard now I'll uh, put the wheels on it tomorrow see you then bye